just gonna do Saturday but I think I might do today and tomorrow tomorrow is Father's Day and we're going to my brother's soccer game and then taking my dad out to dinner so it's gonna be a fun day but today Saturday we are on our way to Kelly's Island and we decided to bring Lucas with us because he deserves to go he's never been on a boat before so it'll be really interesting do you think he's gonna like the boat? No. No? Probably not. Um, but yeah, so it'll be really fun. And I'm, we got some, we got some flowers here. They're in vases. Um, and I'm actually going to be um, like photographing a proposal. So it's very exciting. And we're just gonna kind of make like an afternoon of it. It's 2.30 right now. Um, so it takes a little bit to get there to like the ferry and then the ferry is like a 20 minute boat ride and then I think we're going to be doing a lot of walking to get where we need to go but it's going to be very fun and then I think we're probably going to get dinner while we're there on the island and then come home so it's going to be a very long but very fun evening and then tomorrow is Father's Day. We're gonna be going to my brother's soccer game, which of course Lucas is coming because Lucas is the mascot for that team. And then take him out to dinner. So that's gonna be this vlog. Yeah, he doesn't. It's just the car screwdriver when you keep on. Yeah. I don't know if I'll be able to hold some like a rail. I mean, you don't have to hold. <laughs>
25. You hear that, Lucas? No more than 25. Where's the zoom in? My finger's in the zoom. Oh. Oh. Yeah, you're right. This is nice. I'm sorry. That's okay. This thing, yeah, you're also right. These things are annoying. Also, what? These so. things are annoying. Yeah, I know. Come on, buddy. Thank you for taking one. I appreciate you, and I love you. A little divot. I can't see if I have your head in it. You do. I think it's just a left to I'm walking. I was just about to update them. Alright guys, I got both the flowers. We've been walking for what, like an hour? You're right. Yeah, I showed them. I don't know how well they could see it. We've been walking for a long time. We're tired. Lucas is tired but thriving. He's still going. We took a mini break, gave Lucas some water. And, oh, I'm backlit. I don't know how well you can see me. Anyway, um, there's some really cool houses. Some really long driveways. I think we're almost there with like maybe like 10 minutes. Um, we decided not to rent a golf cart because it was gonna be expensive. So we're walking, which you know is great. You know, great for your heart, great for your health. Oh, look at that house. There's some really cool houses here, guys. Um, so anyway, my feet hurt really bad. I did not wear the, the proper attire. But we're almost there. Ow! I just stabbed like really hard grass on my foot. Yeah, learned that the hard way. Um, we're also walking away from all the food. I'm really hungry. We're starting to get a little delirious. Oof. Oh, is this where we turn? <gasps> Hallelujah! Hallelujah! All right, we're almost there, guys. I change, I wouldn't change a thing. Oh my god, we made it. Hey, that's the bench that was in the picture. Okay. 617. And I have no service, so that's that's awesome. So it is 8.50, we're on our way home. I'm exhausted. How do you feel, honey? Tired. Tired. Lucas is pooped. Lucas uh, was not a big fan of the boat, mainly because it was very loud. He did better on the way home, though. He ended up laying down. Um, so when we got there, we decided to walk to the place because we're like, oh, we're not that far. That was a big mistake. Um, yeah, that was a big mistake. We ended up walking for like an hour. It was like an hour 20. Hour 
through 20 to try and find the place. We found it and then we like didn't have service. It was like very, very spotty. So I was texting him saying that I was here. I had set everything up and then he was like, all right, we're leaving in five minutes. So I was like, okay, because they were going to a winery before and I was like, okay, so they're going to be leaving the winery in five minutes. Don't know where that is, but it took us like five, ten minutes to walk the little path or trail or whatever from the road to the beach. So I'm like giving them time and uh, they end up walking out and we're sitting on the bench and I look back and I'm like, I'm so, I'm like pissed because I'm like, I usually ruined it. But she was still super surprised. She was like confused. She thought, cause she just saw like the back of us. So she thought that like they had come in and like ruined like somebody else's like proposal. But it was still super sweet. Obviously she said yes. It was so cute. Um, but yeah. And then they had a gol golf cart. So they, <laughs> they were kind enough to drive us back to like downtown and the what oh I thought you were shaking your head now like, yeah they did um and then we got some dinner and then we were rushing to catch the ferry at eight o'clock we made it with like a few minutes to spare we may or may not have ran a little bit and we may or may not have needed to run a little bit but we did and we made the ferry, we got back around like 8.30. So we are now on our way home. And I think, don't do that. It's not about Luca's the bumper. Oh my, do you wanna tell that story? I don't know if I know all of it. So, along with Lucas's first boat ride, Lucas had his first golf cart ride. I'm kinda glad we didn't end up Oh. Um, so anyway, so they were in the front, Nick and I sat in the back, and Lucas was just kind of chilling half in between us, mainly like on our laps. And you know, at first, when they were first starting out, we were on gravel, it was kind of bumpy, Lucas was not liking it. And we're like, no, it's it's fine, like it's just loud noise, whatever. Do you think it was because of the loud noise? Mm -hmm. Because I stopped freaking out about it. That's true. Um, so it, we think it was like because of how loud it was. But anyway, so we start driving. So we like backed out of the like gravel like semi park area, and then we got on the road. And he starts driving, and Luke is like freaked the flip out and like. I thought he was about to jump off like the back of the golf cart. He ended up like going crazy. He scratched both of us. I think he hit Nick like with his arm because he was front rail flailing. I still didn't say it right. Oh, and he literally like pulled himself out of his harness. And we we're like, whoa, 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 wait, stop, 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 stop. So they stopped the golf cart and we we're like, what? So then. We put the harness back on and then Nick basically just like gripped him super hard and then he like calmed down because he got used to it and he was okay after that but um but yeah I thought he was gonna like just jump off the golf cart I think Nick did too yeah we thought he was just gonna jump it was I, I don't really know what happened it was it was crazy but that's why I have a, a thing on. I want to show, look at that. It's beautiful outside. A beautiful sunny day. Now we got a beautiful sunset that we're driving home to. Yeah, that I think is, that's the update. So that's how today went. It was good. 
exhausting but fun. And we're honestly just gonna go home. I think make some cookies. Make some cookies. And then go the heck to bed. And then tomorrow is gonna be a fun, busy day as well. So stay tuned because I think I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow. in here so yeah it's sunday night it is literally 9 56 almost 10 o'clock i just um cut nick's hair because we didn't really have time or do it earlier this weekend so i just did it at you know 9 30 but it's fine i took lucas to my brother's soccer game today and it was it was so hot we're like i actually all week it's gonna be in the 90s here and we're under like excessive heat warnings i took water for him um and i also took an umbrella to like uh what's the word like open it up so he could be under it and be in shade which he loved he pretty much spent like the whole time under an umbrella in shade um and then he did drink some of the water and then I also took some of the water and like put it on him every so often too to help kind of cool him down. And Nick told me this morning, so Nick and I went to breakfast this morning and he told me, he said, can you please put sunscreen on today? I was like, yeah, I'll do that. Well, I forgot. So, um, Uh, your girl got a little burnt, just a little bit. My back, I don't think is, I tried to like rotate because I remembered when I was there and I literally said to my mom, I was like, Nick's going to be mad at me because I forgot to put sunscreen on when he asked me. And like, must... okay, ignore all of the hair, but like. Oops. <laughs> But anyway, so yeah, I took Lucas. I'm sorry, you guys are crooked, but like the box that you're on is just kind of. Anyway, so I took Lucas to my brother's soccer game. It was really nice. My dad was there, my mom was there. Um, and then afterwards, we took my parents. Oh, not my parents. We took my dad out for dinner. And we ended up at City Barbecue. It was really good whole pork sandwich delicious and then we came back home and we chilled oh, I gotta, no never mind I did upload my video oh, my word. I also this morning before my brother's game I worked on my video for tomorrow got that edited got the thumbnail made and then after dinner we did I did upload my video now I need to now I need to fold our laundry and put everything away yeah I think that's all I have left to do yeah so yeah so it's been a fun busy weekend um yeah I'm exhausted Nick and I have been so freaking exhausted today and even Lucas has kind of been a little, a little bit more like mellow and tired today, just from yesterday. And then, you know, 
And in this side, I don't know what we're gonna get today. So it is now officially 10 o'clock and I need to go fold laundry and go to bed because I have to be to work at 8 a.m. tomorrow. So that means your girl's getting up at 5.30 so she can work out, but it's all good. I choose to wake up at 5.30 because I prefer to work out in the morning because it just kind of sets me up for the day a lot better. And then um, we have, I have volleyball. I have volleyball tomorrow night. It's gonna be so hot. It's gonna be in the 90s. And I think Nick is filling in for um, the other girl that's on her team. She's gonna be late. So Nick's, I think, gonna fill in for her at least for a little bit and then um and then she'll play um but i'm also excited so for like the second half of the summer the group of four that i'm with we're gonna do like another fours but we're also gonna do a team of six so nick is gonna join us and my dad is gonna join us and fun fact um my dad used to play volleyball and he was actually in the Paralympics in 1992. So it's kind of funny because one of the other players on our team, they're like, oh, well, you're the child of an Olympian because I play with me and my brother. And so, you know, they'll make that joke uh, about the two of us sometimes. But yeah, so I'm really excited about that. Um, it's going to be so much fun. It's still going to be in the sand, um, but there's going to be six of us. So super excited for that and yeah i'm still i'm still trying to like figure out this whole new balance between work and youtube and also like finding time for myself with uh you know just recharging my battery as far as you know like reading or doing something that i love and enjoy that's not work um and yes technically right now youtube is more of just a hobby it's something fun that i do love um i i do love editing and you know it does make me happy um and i'm not making money from youtube yet but i still in some regards it is still kind of like work so you know just trying to find things that don't really necessarily relate to any of that, but still make me happy, like reading, you know, taking this park or something like that. So, just working on this balance, but please bear with me. <laughs> um, so, yeah. But that's gonna be it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Um, yeah, I feel like it was kind of sporadic, kind of not sporadic, I don't, I don't know. Let me know. I want your guys' honest opinions in the comments. Have you been liking my style of vlogs? Um, do you not like them? Do you want to see something different with them? Because I, I think I do like a lot of like montage and then like kind of like recap, um, which I think can be kind of fun. But do you want maybe like a mixture of like maybe some talking also while I'm out? Um, step out of my comfort zone and vlog in public around people. <laughs> um, you know, just, just let me know in the comments below. Um, I love and appreciate every single one of you and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.